five great movies. Like these were really good and they're like my new favorites. So I'm just gonna jump right into them and that's awesome. Let's make this quick before my fucking earring falls off again. Hey everyone, it's Carly and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to actually be something different on my channel. I never usually do these and this is going to be a October movie wrap up. What? Yeah. So I decided I'm gonna probably try and start doing like movie wrap ups and TV show wrap ups at the end of every month. And I don't know if it's gonna be every month per se because I don't know if I'll watch a movie in a month. So I really don't know. Every month's different. So this month I happened to watch five horror movies. I, I know, I know. I never usually watch horror movies and so recently I've been really getting into them and I'm really loving them. So they're great movies. Like these were really good. And Okay, so the first one that I watched was Sinister, the first one. I, for some reason, remembered myself watching this before because when it first started up, it just reminded me of something that I've seen before. And so if you don't know what this movie's about, it's basically about, if I can get this right, it is about the how these kids when you move into like a family and a home it it could be possessed it could not be but like the kids will be picked i guess you could say by the sinister person and they have to like murder their entire family and then they have to film it and so it's really fucking gruesome and gory and it was just so fucking good it didn't have a lot of jump scares which i did like but definitely did have like the good aspect to it like the good horror aspect to it and i did love watching it it, was, it dragged me in and it made you feel creepy and weird and i just liked that and how it was shown in the movie so it was really good and then because i watched the first one i had to watch the second one so i watched the second one with my friend i gave that a 4.5 i gave the first one a 5 and i, I gave this one 4.5 the second one was definitely more gruesome i want to say because in this one, this boy is picked and he is shown from the other kids, like their murders movies that they made about their parents being murdered and stuff like that. And he had to watch them. And then all of a sudden it decided that he wasn't gonna be the one that, pick, that was picked, it was his brother. And so it's just crazy. Like you just have to watch them. They're just so fucking good. And then the third one that I, re that I watched was The Shining. For the first time ever, I watched it and I gave it a five stars. And so I actually picked up the book last month a little bit and I still have yet to finish it because it's really dense, but I have watched The Shining and I really enjoyed it. It was really good and it I didn't know what to expect going into it, so I kind of just went kind of blind. My friend and I have been watching all of these movies together through FaceTime and it's been so fun just because we like will like talk during it and like we'll see each other's reactions. So it's just like really entertaining and fun. And then the fourth one that I read that I also gave five stars was The Conjuring. And I know this is like a really popular, like super scary movie. Also Sinister is supposed to be said it's the scariest movie ever. But honestly, I think The Conjuring scared me more than a Sinister did, which was good because I have more jump scares and I definitely, I really like The Conjuring. They live in, they move into this house and like they get possessed and stuff like that. And obviously it's about like being like possessed and like demonic things and all that kind of stuff. And it's just like these ghost hunters come in and they kind of like, banish the ghost and like have to deal with it and it's really cool because like it's like a ghost hunter show but it's like them coming to a house and I just want more of those so I definitely want to watch more Conjuring movies because they were so good and so the fifth and last one that I uh, read read watched this month was Conjuring 2 and that one was really good that was the last one that I watched and I gave that 4.5 but it might have been one of my favorites because I still keep thinking about it and I watched it like last week but it was really good and this one specifically was about this girl who gets possessed by the nun and this is where the nun starts to come in and Annabelle as well because like they're all kind of like connected in a way because of the people that make those movies all make these. Um, I learned all this from my friend who like watches all these horror movies. So it's pretty cool again because we watched it all together. And so I really enjoyed this one as well. I, um, again, it was about this girl who gets possessed with a nun who is being like controlled by the nun. Uh, the nun is controlling this older guy who died in like their house and stuff like that. And then it like reciprocated because these are all true stories. So it all of these are all true stories that happened and then like the paranormal investigators have to come in and they deal with a bunch of shit at their house because like they collect things that they take back from where they went to locations at and it's really cool it was just it was really spooky and fun and i really enjoyed it i really enjoyed all these movies like this was like a really fun month of just watching all these movies and it just makes me want to keep watching more so if you guys have any really great horror scary movies that, that you think i should watch that i'll like based off of these or anything just please comment them down below i'm always looking for more horror movies like please let me know. I would love to watch some more good ones. I have AMC on Amazon. I have Amazon Prime and then I also have Shudder on AMC 
and then I also have like Hulu and Netflix so anything that are on those that are really good horror movies please let me know so that's that's basically it for this wrap-up wow so I hope you guys enjoyed this little different thing that I did on my channel and if you did give it a big like subscribe down below join the family and I'll see you on my next video bye guys mm -hmm.